And that's it. Not bad. He's, he's, he's still munching. Okay, get that feast going. Hey buddy, it's crazy good time for and welcome back to some more plants versus zombies in the last episode We took care of Vase breaker. We did all of vase breaking in one episode and also checked out vase breaker endless pretty nice And in this episode we will be starting on I zombie now as you can see It's already completed with the I zombie endless having a streak of two reason why is because I had like two failed recordings um Apparently, while recording, there was an encoding overload in OBS. I didn't really think much of it. I think I just thought it was just like there. Uh, for the moment, like I thought it was the thing to do with space, but apparently it wasn't. It was a thing with my quality preset or whatever. I don't know, something like that. And I rewatched the video because I was gonna edit it, and the frame rate was absolutely disgusting. The audio is perfectly fine. It's just the frame rate of the video. Frick me. So I have to redo this. I have to redo this video and an episode. So bear with me. I deeply apologize for this, but it would take a while. It would take a, a lot of effort and precision to like get to where I'm, where I am, or where I was at the end of the last episode. So let's get started. I zombie. Now I zombie is really cool. Oh, da Crazy Dave explains it again. Thank you so much, Crazy Dave. The zombies asked me to help them practice invading houses. I told him it'd be okay as long as no plants were harmed. So I put a bunch of cardboard cutouts on your lawn. Have fun. So, I zombie is really cool. The whole idea is you get to play as a zombies and you have to go, you know, basically bust through the plants. Now, obviously, this row is going to be really easy because it's literally just a bunch of sunflowers. So, using a regular zombie will be useful. Um, obviously, as I zombie continues, it's going to get more and more difficult, which is not going to be enjoyable. But overall, I personally like iZombie more than Vasebreaker. I don't know why. Maybe because it... I mean, both require a lot of strategy, but Vasebreaker is more like RNG based, while iZombie is more like... is more like... on the basis of like thinking about uh, your setup. <sighs> now what could I do? How about... I want to I want to do like a f bucket head for the you know screw it let's do a bucket head for this row I was thinking about football zombie but I'm like eh, I don't know that's probably not the best idea so yeah I mean so I zombie super simple all you gotta do is get through the plants and eat the brain and then boom that's that's the end well that's that's that would be each row down and once all rows are finished you know but that's it uh, you complete the mini game um you know what I'll put a bucket head for this one as well. And screw it, for this one too. For this one on the other hand, uh, I'm probably gonna do like a regular zombie just to like, trigger the squash. Like there. Okay, nice. Should I do a regular zombie? I, I feel, I'm afraid, you know what, screw it, we might as well. I feel like, he, I feel like he's got it. Well, he's not gonna get through the whole thing, obviously, but... He'll definitely trigger the, the, the squash. Trigger the squash, do that. Okay, now he can get through pretty easily. He's gonna get beaten by the squash, 100%, but overall it shouldn't be too bad. Okay, you know what, screw it. I'm gonna get a football zombie going for that, simply because the football zombie is a bit faster. It's, it, well, it is the fastest one out of, you know, all three of these. And because I'm slowed down, it just makes things really difficult. <laughs> all right, that's that, and boom. The first level of Ice Zombie has been finished. Very nice. Um, it's gonna be very interesting. Hopefully I can get through this in one episode. I mean, in the field recording I did. So, yeah. Oh yeah, and that's what happens when you complete something that you already completed and get a reward for it. You get just like a bag of coins with, I believe, like five gold coins. Um, originally you would get like a trophy with like, I think two diamonds or something like that. So yeah. Anyways, I Zombie 2, the sequel. Hmm, okay. I definitely want to use a screen door zombie for this. Because screen door zombies cannot be affected um, by, you know, any pea shooters. Well, obviously the screen door can, but not the zombie itself, which will make them really useful. The only problems they're going to have is like dealing with the spike weed, but overall that shouldn't be too terrible. I'll put one down here and screw, I'll put one down here. 
He will get injured by the spike weed, but like it's not gonna be enough to kill him. Two, two probably will kill him, but luckily there aren't two. Now I have to figure out what to do for these top two rows, cause these three rows are finished. You know what? Screw it. I'm. Oh, hello. Hey, you got a plan for the Zen Garden. Very nice. I'll do bucket head for that. And I might do bucket head for the second row as well. So well, let's do it. Bucket head. Hopefully it'll work. I mean, I could I could just like if I wanted to, I could just put like a bucket head and a screen door. Screw it. Let's do it. I mean, I had the sun. And my sun is going to reset, you know, once I finish a level, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, he's got it. Not bad. All right, it's another really easy level. Well, to be fair, it is like only the second one. So, come on, you got it. And there we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now, ever since, um, in the previous two uh, failed recordings, I did buy something in the shop. Oh, now it's time for Can You Dig It? I hope I can. Oh boy, digger zombies. I wonder how that's gonna be done. I can do a digger zombie right here, but uh. You know, then I won't have any sun left. Here would be the best choice, honestly. Screw it, let's do it. Um, what was I gonna say? Frick, uh... Yeah, I bought some- in the previous two episodes, in the, the failed recordings, I did buy something. I don't- I'm not exactly remembering what I bought, but I think I just simply bought, uh, some more of the pow power to plants. Uh... I'll let you know which ones I bought. I'm not a, I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I'm trying to remember. Yeah, we'll we'll see, we'll see. Okay, and to take care, take care of that, and boom, that's it. I'm gonna use him to just get rid of the potato mine, and then. I mean, he's the same thing as Buckethead, although I would have to use more sun to like get through there. Screw, it, I'll use a Buckethead for this. And for this one, I guess Digger. Digger's probably the best choice. Simply because he won't be affected by any of these plants and he can just like eat them all. Buckethead could probably pull through this row, but even then, it's a very risky one for him. I mean, because three pea shooters and two of them have the have access to the torchwood. So, yeah. Uh, he can definitely take care of the pea shooter. He'll dive in a potato mine, but overall, it shouldn't be too bad. Let's just do this. Help him out. Do that, and then there, and boom, perfect. Now the final one. I'll go Buckethead. He'll take a little bit of damage from the Torchwood, but hopefully he can pull through. That's screw it. I'll use the Digger's Army just to help him out. Just to help the brother out. Make it make his expedition a little easier. Oh yeah, that digger zombie probably would have definitely died, you know, um, if the buckethead zombie wasn't there. Oh, what? I didn't even realize there was one more brain. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. Because I I'd used a digger zombie for that row, so I didn't realize. Well, that's that's my fault. Um, but either way, very it's still a very simple level. I'm not excited for later though because I know how I do remember how difficult it gets. Gosh, it's gonna be not fun <laughs> to, to say the least. Come on, zombie, you got it. You got it. Very nice. Okay, that's another bag of money collected. I need some water. Mm. Very nice. Okay. Now we have Totally Nuts. Based on the title, you can already tell what we're going to be dealing with. Walnuts. Huh. I think I had a deal with this. I mean, I'm going to have to... Either way, I'm going to have to pull out a, uh, a ladder zombie. Um, these two are the exact same, so I'm just gonna do it for this one. He'll get some sun. He's not gonna get all the way through because, you know, the pea shooter's all the way back here. But he'll, he'll get some wear. I'll definitely put another one right here. And screw it, let's get a, uh, let's get a regular zombie. He's definitely not gonna survive. He's gonna get killed in like a few more hits. Never mind, he got it. Okay. What a chad. Oh, he's not gonna make it though, is he? 
maybe. Yo, okay. Very nice. I'm gonna have to get one right here and one right here. You're gonna be in the exact same situation. And uh, screw it, I guess one right here. I mean, I'm gonna have to use a ladder zombies. I'm not just gonna like wait for the zombies to, um, you know, uh, munch on the wa on the walnuts because they're gonna die before that even happens. I'll use a. You know what? I'll use a ladder zombie for this because ladder zombies have the sh have the ladder to protect them. Mm-hmm. Very smart, isn't it? I'll do. There, he'll be able to get through, but you know what? Buckethead will help. Actually, he doesn't need a bucket head. Wow, okay, that went by much better than I thought it would. I only had like, what, two ladder zombie deaths and that's it? Not bad. Okay, next one, we have Dead Zeppelin, a little, you know, uh, what's it called? Uh, oh, frick, uh, a little play on, a play on the uh, band's name, Led Zeppelin. That's pretty cool. I don't want to use a bungee zombie yet. Once I get enough sun, I'm definitely going to use a bungee zombie on the magnet room. That's probably the best idea. Buckethead, I should definitely use somewhere. How... I need to test something out. How good is the radius um, on the magnet room? You know what? S screw it, I'm just do it here. He'll definitely be able to like get uh, these two uh, sunflowers eaten, but I don't know if he'll make it to the end. I'll get rid of the bungee zombie because I need to get rid of him. Bucket heads are like essential for I zombie, so yeah. Um, now I can just put a bucket through bucket head through there, but I need more sun. Come on, you got it. There we go, perfect. Uh, bucket head right there. Now what do I what do I want to do? You think a bucket I could survive this? You know what? Let's it's worth a shot. It is literally worth a shot. Let's try it. He's definitely not gonna survive that. Come on, come on, make it, make it, make it, make it. Oh shoot, okay. I hope he can make it though. That's what I'm worried about. I don't know if he can. Screw, I'll help him out. Nice, then he's gonna take care of it. Perfect, okay. He's gonna be able to make it through. Um, so that's already, what, three rows down? At least last two, uh, gonna be difficult. I wanna use a balloon zombie, but screw it, let's use a... Do I wanna use a balloon zombie? I mean, they'll be useful, but I don't think they'll be um, good enough for what I have remaining. How about let's do a bucket head right there. Yeah, we'll do that. And then we'll also do a bucket head right here. And see how that goes. Okay, and overall shoot. You know what, he's gonna take a while, so I'm gonna just- Oh, well, no, I, you know what, I did not think about that. <laughs> I did not think about that at all. That's my fault. Let's just do this. Take care of him. Quickly. Yep, there we go. Okay, now this balloon zombie is gonna fly over and just get the last brain. I I know I wasted a lot of sun, but it's it's whatever. As long as it works. And that's it. Not bad. He's 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 still munching. Okay, get that feast going. All right, next one we have me smash. F ooh, okay. Now we got the gargantuar. Very nice, but like. That's what, how much sun? 300 sun, that's a lot of sun. I definitely wanna use a javelin zombie, or sorry, a pole vaulting zombie. I'm gonna use him. You know what, right here, he can easily take care of this row. He won't get affected by the garlic, and there's literally no pea shooters to um, get powered up by the torchwood. So yeah, this one's perfectly fine for the javelin. I'm thinking about using javelin on this one, but I don't know how well he can do against, you know, the spike. You know what, let's give it a shot. He's only 75 sun. Which is like 25 more than the uh, regular zombie, so... Now, question. Where do I use the uh, Gargantuar? Because I definitely want to use him at some point. You know, I have an idea. How about get a Javelin zombie going here. He'll get squashed by the squash. And then just have the... 
Just have the gargantuar go through. You might as well. Freaking butter. Oh my gosh. It's so annoying. Oh yeah. Sunnice Hiyashi, I don't know if you guys, uh, if I've mentioned this before in the Let's Play, but Sunnice Hiyashi uses a, uh, a, an actual zombie as like a, a, a smashing like post, and it's literally so freaking hilarious. Like, uh, <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. Um, I have the sun, so I might as well. This I'll just use a regular zombie. And then just get like a gargantuar going. I have the sun, you know, I might as well just use what I have. It's just the smartest thing, in my personal opinion. And three gargantuars in one level. Kind of crazy. If this was, if I was like actually playing through this level, like with plants, I'd be having a hell of a time. <sighs> okay, there we go. Not bad. Both have been taken care of. Uh, he's gonna be, probably, probably going to be a little slow, so I'm going to help him out. You got it. Actually, I don't even know if the pole vaulter was like even smart. Yeah, it's, it's whatever. He'll still run through. He's got it. Okay, cool. Very nice. Another another one down. Uh, now we got zomboogie. So we're gonna be having some dancing zombies. Very cool. Um, I have an idea. I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna do that. Okay, that works out well because. Chomper's busy. He can get through. The, he can th get through there and take care of uh, the Chomper and the Sunflower. He will die from the peach, from the potato mine. But uh, then I'm gonna send another one. Actually, I could just send a pole vaulter. Then I won't have to waste more sun on another regular zombie. Daniel, you're you're so smart. Come on. This one I might just have to either use like a bunch of uh, pole vaulters. I'm probably just gonna use a bunch of pole vaulters on this. I'll jump over that. Eat the sunflower, die. He's gonna jump over that. Eat the sunflower, die. And then just get another pole vaulter. Okay, it works, yeah. Let's do it. Okay, good job. Very smart, very smart. Now for uh, for the final ones, I'm not sure about these. These are gonna be very difficult. Um, I mean, there's two sunflowers. You know what, I can definitely get just a regular zombie going for this. He can eat one sunflower. Which is good. And then I'll get another one. Might as well help him out. He's gonna eat my chomper, but it shouldn't be too bad. Okay, I have an idea. Hmm. Actually, will this idea even work? I wanna use it. I wanna use a dancing zombie. I mean screw it, might as well just do this. Dun 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 dun. I mean dancing zombies not gonna be really useful at this point, because like it's just the way the worlds are like kind of spread out. It's, it doesn't work well. Uh, let's do this. Um, how about take care of these two, and he can eat th through those. I mean, like at this point, I might as well just try it out. See how well it works. He's gonna die from that, obviously. As long as the main dancer zombie doesn't die, then we're good. Because he's gonna spawn another one. He's gonna take the hit. Please spawn another. Please spawn another. Thank you so much. And please spawn another. Soon! Thank you. Oh my gosh, that was close. So yeah, he's got it. He's got it taken care of. Uh, I'm just gonna pull Walter to make this go faster. Yeah, dancer zombie is, got take, take, is gonna take care of this entire row. Very good on him, though. Very good. All right, cool. Now he's gonna have to eat him, but... And there we go, we have, what, how much? 300 sun to spare. We could have spawned in the Gargantuar if we had access to it, but... Dang, Gargantuar? That's very interesting. Apparently the dancing zombie is more expensive than the Gargantuar. I mean, I guess that makes sense because, to be fair, the dancing zombie and I zombie seems a little more useful. Then the Guardian War? I don't know why. I, I just feel it like that way. Now we got three hit wonder. Wow, we got a lot of uh, zombies to choose from. Maybe actually you have imps as well. Okay, how do I want to do this? Mm. Okay. No, it's not going to work. Conehead. Yes, Conehead's going to be able to get through this whole entire row. I can just tell. 
He won't get affected by the magnet shroom because his cone head is made out of plastic, not metal. Um, and it's only two plants he has to deal with. And then just the rest is the sunflowers. Okay, very good. Very nice. Um, let's just... I feel like for... I kind of just wanted to get, get this imp going, just to take care of that, uh, squash. And then, the other three I'm gonna have to do the ladder zombie, but I don't know. You know what? Screw it. Let's do this. Let's get rid of, um, this magnet room. And while we're at it, this magnet room as well, because I know they're gonna be not fun to deal with. Okay, now I can get a ladder zombie. Let's get a ladder zombie going for here. And screw it, a digger zombie might as well help this guy out. He's not gonna make it, that's for sure, but he can try. <laughs> he can definitely try. You know, ladder zombies are fast. I might as well just use another one. Uh, and then once. Oh yeah, imps. Oh yeah. Also, for some reason, imps don't. Never mind. They do. Uh, screw it. Ladder zombie. Uh, let's do an imp for this. Imps whenever- they do, what the heck? I don't know why, but I remember imps like not climbing ladders for whatever reason in the, in the failed recording. It's... Okay, I- that's strange. Please hurry up, ladder zombie, so the imp doesn't get killed by the potato mine. He's gonna get killed by the potato mine. He didn't! Oh, that's good. Uh, ladder? Just take care of it. Okay. That actually went by really well. He's gonna take a while to- he's gonna just keep feasting on that walnut. I apologize for that, but... Something that's just gonna be happening, so we're gonna hear some munching. Actually, no, what the heck? How did he- wait, how did he take care of the walnut so fast? That was strange. He must have, like, insanely good teeth, frick. How- how the heck did- I don't know. Anyways, the final regular one, all your brains are belong to us. I love how that's, uh, how that sentence is formed. This one is just gonna be an imp killing fest. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't have to be, but it might as well be. This one could just be a buckethead kind of uh, scenario, but the mandate room is gonna be very annoying to deal with. So I'm gonna get, you know what? Let's do a pole vaulter right here. Take care of that. He's gonna pole vault again, get that, and he's gonna die from that. But I'm gonna, oh, the three Peter. Farts and the star fruits, yo. Okay, this turned out to be much more difficult than I thought it would be. Please take care of him. Yes. Okay. Good. Very good. Very good. Um. Okay. How do I want to do this? <laughs> it's gonna be tough. I can't use a Mudgy Zombie yet. That's gonna be 125 sun. I'm gonna have 75 sun left. Yeah, it's not gonna be enough. I would like to get a bucket head going for this row. Football will be good, but like, I need, to, once again, I need to get rid of this manage room. You know, I'm gonna use an imp. Just to take care of that. Good, okay. I'll use another imp. He should be able to get through that chomp. Yeah, okay, good, 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 good. And hopefully, I don't know how well this is gonna work, but hopefully a, a cone head can get through a decent amount of this. This one's really difficult, because it requires a lot of thinking and a little bit of timing. Because you have to, like, make sure you pull out the uh, uh, the zombies, like, at the perfect time. Especially with, like, things like, uh, when dealing with things like, um, potato mines. He's not gonna get through, especially since there is a chomper waiting for him. So, I guess I just go for another, uh, cone head. I wanna use- I wanna use what's so- what's so bad. You know what? We're gonna do it. Once this- once this manage room is down, that's- it's gonna make things so much more easier. And there we go. Just get some of that sun. Okay, good. Get a bucket head going for here. No, yeah, screw it. We'll make it. We'll make this an easier uh, thing for him. So just vault over that. Oh gosh, he's he he's lost an arm. Hopefully, he can still make it. He's gonna get through that plant. Oh, that's good. Okay, he made it. What a chat, he made it through. But I have zero sun left. I have zero sun left and I'm getting destroyed. Come on. Okay. How am I gonna do this? 
I have to use a, a, a ladder zombie for this. I have to. How do I want to play this? I'll get a ladder zombie going. It's probably a terrible timing, but... Oh, it's a terrible timing. What am I doing? Screw it. Cone head. Help him out. Nice. Okay. Okay. He, that, that's the stopey taken care of. He's gonna definitely get pelted by those guys, but hopefully he can actually get like a bunch of sun. Oh, and the freaking star fruits. Oh my gosh. That guy is annoying as heck. Two hundred twenty-five sun. So I'm I'm literally in the same position as I was previously. Oh my gosh! You don't know how much I want a uh, what's it called? Um, what's their names? A the the guys. What are they called? Um, balloon zombies. Yes, I want them so freaking badly right now, but I don't have access to them. So part of me tells me. Part of me says to use a digger zombie for here, just to get rid of the pea shooter. And then eat the sunflower and just get an imp to fi fire through. That'll be a total of 175 sun, which will leave me with 50 sun left. But then the sunflower. You know what? Let's try it. I like the idea. Let's test it out. Let's test it out. See how it goes. Hopefully it goes well. Who knows? <laughs> okay, come on. Take care of him. And there, nice. Now we can just get an imp going. Freaky heck the star fruits. Oh my gosh, please survive, imp. Please survive. Oh thank goodness. Whew. That was way too freaking close. Um 250 sun. Okay. I'm I have like 25 more sun than I did previously. Ladder, we'll do it. I mean, the ladder is gonna have like is a really good shield for him. Although he will be pelted by three plants at once. Okay, he got through the star fruits. Just survive of that ladder. Survive of that ladder. Very nice. Okay, 275 sun. Two rows left. This one, uh, I should probably take care of this one first. Football zombie that will bring me down to a hundred sun. Seventy-five. We'll do it. Let's go, football zombie. You got this, my guy. You know what? Let's take care of this row too. Come on, football zombie, make it through. Make it through. You got this. You got this in the bag. Two plants left to go. Oh, besides the sunflower. Come on, you got it. You got it. Easy money. Easy money. Come on, you got it, you got it, my G. Let's go, let's go! Oh, my guy made it through. Oh, what a chat. Just do that and just, yeah. You know what? Hop him out. Imps are faster anyways. Probably should've just used an imp, <laughs> but it's whatever. Oh, there we go. All your brains are belong to us is finished. Goodness me, that was really tough. I didn't how, for some odd reason I didn't fail that, which is amazing. That was that was really difficult. All the other ones were either were all the other ones were like pretty gosh darn easy. I mean, three hit wonder was a little bit on the difficult side, but not really. This one, oh my gosh, that was tough. All right, so now we're just gonna end it off with doing like two things of uh, I Zombie. Let's do a new game, start from fresh. So these are the zombies we're gonna be getting. We're gonna have like throughout the whole thing. So how do I want to how do I want to start this off? I mean, obviously there's this boy right here, which is gonna be annoying as heck, and a three peter fart. Um, hmm. Something tells me I want to start off with a with a cone head here. He will die before he gets to the end, but he should get some damage going. Actually, maybe here. I'll test it out. I'll test it out. See how it goes. There's a repeater, but the repeater only got four shots in. The only thing left for him to deal with is the uh, spike weed. 
when it comes to like him taking damage. Hopefully he should be able to make it. This I'm probably just gonna do like a football zombie. At this point, I might as well just do a football zombie. Doom, 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 doom. Oh, a dancing zombie would be fun. But I wanna use my son, I wanna use like my son, you know, smart. <laughs> like in a smart way. Okay, very good, very good. Ladder zombie would be good as heck, but I need to get rid of that mana trim, so screw it. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna get rid of it with a bungee zombie. And then I'm probably gonna use a ladder zombie, probably either this row or this row. I'm gonna do this row simply because it has three sunflowers, which is really gosh darn good. And he's, him himself, he himself is only gonna get damaged by the uh, spike weed. The pea shooters are only gonna hit his ladder, and his ladder has a lot of defense, so he should be fine. And you know what? I'll get a digger zombie for this. Oh yeah, yeah, I definitely need a digger zombie for this. Yeah, he like he only made it with he almost didn't make that. Like he only he has one arm left. He lost his arm. Uh so how do I want to do this? What sucks is that the heater is turning on. It's a good thing I know I, I, I'm able to noise cancel. Because if I didn't, whew, this would not be fun. Uh, part of me wants to use a, you know, screw bucket head. Gosh, I'm stupid butter. Oh, I hate that so much. How, hmm, should I just... I don't know how well that's going to work, though. I think I'm just gonna let the digger zombie take care of uh, the snow pea and then just like speed through with an imp. I think that's the best idea. There we go, perfect. All right, steward butter, stop. I don't need this right now. You're very annoying. The last one, How, what the heck am I gonna do for the last one? I guess football zombie? Let's do it. Football zombie it is. He's gonna get, you know, a little slowdown from the snow pee. But hopefully he can still make it through. He's definitely gonna be able to d get rid of the first two plants. 100%. Come on. Freaking butter. Oh my gosh. That pisses me off so much. Come on, just make it through, please. I beg of you. Butter again. Ah. I hate this. I get you gotta be joking with me. Freaking heck, screw it. I'm just gonna do this. Just in case butter this all of a sudden comes to destroy today. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you, you thought you think that's gonna take care of my zombies? No. Okay, goodness me, that was tough. Oh, that's one down. That's one streak. Now the second one. Um, how the heck am I gonna do this? Uh, wow. Bungee zombie would be nice for this, but once again, need to get rid of the. I need to get rid of the umbrella leaf. Starfruit's gonna. Okay, no, that's tough. That is indeed a toughie. You know what? I'll I'll attempt this. I'll attempt this with the cone head. The only thing that's gonna be damaging him, oh, starfruit! Oh my gosh, I keep forgetting about that stupid starfruit. Okay, that was only like two shots from the starfruit. He should be able to make it through the magnet room, hopefully, and then he'll die from the uh, potato mine. And then I'll just use uh, this guy to jump over the uh, three Peter. All right, well that's good. Okay, first row already finished. Now, what the heck am I gonna do for the other ones? Um, this one's gonna require a ladder zombie, that's for sure. Well, now that we don't have the mana to worry about, I might as well just use the ladder zombie right now. He'll eat, he'll eat those two plants, he'll hop over the, uh, the walnuts, and, uh, and he should be fine, as long as the spike weed doesn't take him down, which might actually happen, which I'm a little worried about, but hopefully it should be fine. Um, Buckethead, I might want to just like have him like bolt through that or either that or football zombie. 
Uh, I definitely want to you get him occupied. Yep, yeah, that's perfect. And then get you know what? Screw. It. Let's get a, let's get a um a conehead going. Conehead probably will not make it through. Well, obviously, because you know chomper. But uh, hopefully he can at least make it to the chomper. The puff shroom is gonna be sorry. The fume shroom is gonna be very annoying. But he should have it in the bag. I don't see why he wouldn't. Um, let's get. Okay, that that was so freaking instant. I don't know why, but that like startled me. Um, let's go with a f football zombie right here. Let's just do it. I mean, at this point, I have like 1,100 sun with sunflower coming in the way. Oh, there's a three peat. That freaking three peter. Holy crap! That, that guy annoys me. And it's star fruit too. Like what the fr? Like what's with this guy? Hate him. You know what? I'm gonna just take care of. Yeah, just do this. And I don't know how well this is gonna work, but I'm gonna get a bucket head going. Ah, oh, fart the freaking chomper. Oh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do this. Nice. Wow, the 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 football zombie like barely even made it through. You know what? I'll make it easier. Just do this. Have him hop over the uh, kernel pulse, and boom. Now the question is, can he make it? He's on his last phase, which scares me. But hopefully, with enough luck... Come on, come on... A little bit more? Yeah, okay, two streaks, very nice. That was, I mean, yeah, it required a lot of thinking, but overall, pretty good. That was actually really nice. Okay, well that's a nice zombie for you guys. Very uh, interesting uh, mini game or puzzle game. Let's actually check out the Zen Garden. We have to uh, water my plants. And also, if you are wondering what I bought, a uh, what did I buy actually? Oh, this is coming soon, so I don't have the ability to get that yet. I bought some plants. I know I already had the galling peas and the twin sunflowers. I bought the fume shroom. I had cattails. And I bought the spike rocks. And I guess I bought the magnet shrooms as well. I'm oh, sorry, the, the gold magnets. I don't know when the heck I bought the gold magnets, but... Those are the ones I bought recently. I don't know if... I feel like one of them I bought on camera. But even then, I'm not 100% sure about that. I want those 10 slots so badly. I really do. I have to really like... Shut up, Chris Dave. I don't care. Okay, let's keep watering the plants. And then off the episodes. And what an episode that was. I mean, I might as well just say, you know, just do my outro. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, while I am watering my plants, I must to tell you uh, to, if you like my content and you want to see more, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell to get notified when I, uh, whenever I upload. I'm back into the uploading um, thing. I know I took like a week long break for whatever reason, probably because I didn't have any videos at all and it's really hard to record during the week, especially with school. Um, but yeah, uh, like and share for friends or random stranger as always. And uh, I guess I'll do a question. What can my question be? I want you guys to answer this question down below in the comments. Um, I zomb- no, how about this? Vase breaker? No, I had a I had a freaking good question. What is your, it's gonna be very similar to the vase breaker episodes, but what is your longest streak in Eye Zombie? That's gonna be my question. Oh, I got an ice room. Okay, two night plants that I cannot do anything with because I do not have a uh, a thing. What's it called? A the, the the right biome. In the next episode, though, well, uh, obviously, comment your snow below. In the next episode, we will be taking care of survival. We started with survival day. Yes, I also did this in the failed recording, and I failed. I also got an achievement. Um, well, obviously there's an eye zombie achievement for, called Better Off Dead, to get a streak of 10 or more, or of 10 in eye zombie endless, which is gonna be really difficult, so I'm probably gonna do that on stream, like the vase breaker one. And I also got the sunny days achievement for accumulating 8,000 sun during a single level. It was, it took a little bit, but it was actually pretty easy. I did it in the survival day episodes, um, so yeah. We'll be checking out his survival day next time. Um, yeah, uh, my social media, uh, you know, Instagram, Twitter, as well as Twitch. So follow me on all those places. 
Uh, they're all down, down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Pop-Tarts. Out.